Hello everyone, my name is Anthony Garofalo and welcome to the very first vlog of Hunting Nevada. Today I'm going to be showing you the fly rod that I inherited from my grandfather and we are going to be taking it to a local fly shop, actually the Reno fly shop, and I'm going to have them outfit the fly rod for me to, to fish off the Truckee River. The Truckee River is our local river that we have here in Nevada and it is it has an abundance of rainbow trout which is primarily what I'm going to be after this season or this summer. Um, I really want to walk you through and take you through this journey with me as I try to become a decent fly fisherman. I, I don't know how well I will be able to pick this up or if I'm going to catch any fish at all but that is the whole point of this. I am dedicated to trying this new type of fishing that I have never done before. And I am going to show you now the gear that I am going to be using. So let's get right into it. I Here's my setup. So I have a six foot six inch uh, Shakespeare Alpha fly rod. And I have also a Fluger Summit 1294 reel. I have no idea if this is a good setup or not. Like I said, I inherited it from my grandfather. So this is going to be interesting. I'm going to go ahead and take it to the shop and hopefully they let me film um, what thoughts they have about the rod and what kind of equipment that I'll need to fly fish on the Truckee River. So without further ado, let's go take this in and see what they outfit me with. Okay, so I'm back from the Reno Fly Shop. Unfortunately, they didn't allow me to film uh, film them as they were explaining what they were setting my rig up with. But I'm going to go ahead and try to explain here uh, as best I can. So what they first gave me was um, this fly box. And he goes, it's for beginners. And he goes, you look like a beginner. <laughs> and I said, yes, I am. So in this fly box... We get a various selection of different flies plus the plus the box and i did not realize how expensive flies are so this little box here was about 50 bucks but he goes you know it's something to start out with and i literally had nothing so i did not mind making this investment in order to um, go ahead and get out there on the water next is my reel they actually my reel was actually set up for a lefty they ended up changing that for me which was nice um they ended up putting some orange backing on the reel as well and they tied that in with the float line which is the brown line that you see here they also put on um this absolute trout line right here i don't know if you can see that and it's a four X nine feet. And so they, they ended up showing me how to tie that on as well. And they also even put on the, uh, or that's the leader. Yes. So they actually put on the leader for me as well. And they showed me how to tie everything on and it was really informative. And I really wish they would have let me film there, but they said that they preferred it. They didn't, which was okay. And the la and they also gave me this indicator as well. And he basically explained this as like your bobber. So if you see this, you know, dunk down into the water, it means that a fish has bought, as, as fish has uh, bitten your bait, and you can go ahead and you know, re like, set the hook and lean back and pull the pull the rod back and set the hook. The last thing um, they told me was my rod is probably going to be a little too short and he told me that i'm gonna want a seven to eight foot rod depending on you know where i'm fishing in the truckee even possibly i could go up to an 11 foot rod so the rod that i'm using is going to be very short for the kind of fishing that i wanted to do i asked him if i was determined to go ahead and use that rod for this fishing video trip, etc. He said, you can do it. Like if you're determined, you can do it. So that's gonna be the plan as of right now. 
Um, in the next video, I am planning on actually going out and fishing and filming that experience as well. I am going to be taking my neighbor who is an experienced fly fisherman and he's going to be able to show me the ropes and how to kind of put this stuff on for me. And I'm going to try to be a sponge in that situation. I'm going to try to soak up as much information as I possibly can in order to like in order to become a decent fly fisherman like I said um it's just going to it's going to be a ride. I am very excited for it. So hopefully this weekend I will have some more content for you and I will be able to go out there to a lake or river of his choosing and just kind of dip my toes in the water, you know, metaphorically and physically speaking. So with that being said, thank you for watching the video. Um, I, I would like you to go ahead and subscribe, comment, like the video. I will have a description down, or I will have a link down in the description or below of all the stuff that I bought and of the Reno Fly Shop, which were an amazing help for me. And um, that's all I have for you guys today. So stay safe and hunt Nevada.